Okay, guys. Welcome back to Truth Be Told Transformations. Thank you for the likes, the comments, and everything. I really appreciate you. I have one more winner to give away, so be sure to go look at the community post I put up. And just comment if this channel's helped you in any way and anything you would like to see to bring to the channel. Um, the next person that does it is going to win um, a, s a small reading and or Reiki healing of their choice. Okay. Congratulations to uh, the first winner in the post. I gave 24 hours. I'll be doing this every time we get another 100 subscribers until we hit um, a thousand. When we hit a thousand, I'm gonna be giving away product. I'm gonna do like three winners. Okay. The um, I appreciate you guys. When you comment, it does help get the, your energy and my readings plus get the readings out to those who need them. When I was shuffling, past life relationship flew out. This is going to be a love reading for Taurus, Virgo, and Capricorn. Okay. I've already prayed, called in the Archangels. So, there was a past life relationship that you had an unrequited love in. Okay. But just, you came from a different way. You could have been engaged to somebody. You could have engaged to this person. Okay, hold on. Maybe you, okay. Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. There's a past life relationship, but there was un an unrequited love, okay? You have definitely known each other in a past life, but there was not enough uh, attraction or chemistry to keep this going. There was just several issues. You could have been engaged to this person. But Spirit's wanting you to let go of control issues because the one for you is coming in and it is safe for you to love. Open your heart and give to receive the highest energy of all. For someone here, this could be this past life person coming back in. It didn't work out in the past and you're going to be giving another chance. It's safe for you to trust and it's safe for you to love, okay? You get one, two more cards for the spirit on the board for Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. Any of the numbers I mentioned could be your life path number and age or numbers you're seeing, angel numbers you're seeing, okay? Something unexpected. Yeah, there's a lot of passion here and it's going to be unexpected. You could be going through a separation. So someone here is going to, is in a separation period. You got in a big fight. This isn't going to work out. We're different people. I feel like this fight was explosive. You are definitely connected in a past life. I do feel that you will get back together and this person could be coming in to ask you to marry them. Spirit's wanting you to let go of control issues. Give it to them. Give it to the divine. Because this could be the one. Spirit's saying it is safe for you to love and tr have trust and faith. The situation is calling for you to have faith that this person can truly change and you guys can work out your differences. Okay, there's a lot of passion here. And you are currently in separation. So this is somebody from the past that's coming back. Let's get some more details out here before I pull any more. Let me shuffle this love oracle. Oops. Listen to your intuition. You feel this person. You know their energy is near. Yeah, somebody's coming to propose to you from your past. I do feel like you are, you have dated this person before, or they're coming and saying they want you back, okay? They might ask you to go on vacation with them, or they could, there could be a distance, or you could live far apart from each other. There is a fear that you'll be hurt again from this person. I do feel this is going to be totally unexpected. You do not expect this to come in. You were a third party before in this situation, okay? There was definitely third party energy here put you at a crossroads, you weren't sure what to do, I feel like you made a choice to split up with this person, but you deeply love this person, this person was is coming in as a player in this past energy, they're very charming, okay, your boundaries are being tested, spirit saying enforce healthy boundaries, but don't be afraid to take a chance and roll the dice, make them prove if they truly love you and they're truly sorry and they, you know, I feel like some time has gone by, this person could have been in, in talk uh, this person may come in and call you or get a hold of you when they're drunk or they could have had a drinking problem in the past I feel like th they need liquid courage um, so finances are here 
when home is here. Hmm. You could have lived with this person or they may ask you to move in with them. They're, I feel like they want to you're gonna want to take care of the bills. All right. Let's see what else. Okay, toxic relationship. Hold on. It is up to you whether you take this person back or not, okay? I do, I am getting a toxic relationship. I do feel that it's like, I've been getting this message that someone new is coming in. You've got options, but this past person does not want you to move on to anyone else, okay? This was a very toxic relationship. It was very codependent. There's a lot of, there's a lot of triggers here, okay? This person could have gambled a lot, drank a lot, gone out a lot, spent money frivolously. You could have lived with this person. Yeah or you're currently in this situation. Spirit says there's a storm warning here and you need to surrender to the divine. This is a toxic situation. I'm sorry, don't shoot the messenger. All right, let's get some hidden truth, okay, from this person. You could already be back with this person. I'm getting a couple different timelines here. I feel like this is a warning. You're like, I feel like you have hope and faith that this will hoping this person has changed, but I don't They say they can be their self. I can be myself with you. You let me down. This is messages from this person. I can't be with you. I feel like they are very much a player and a cheater. I feel like um, they've done this to you in a past. Okay, thank you, Spirit. They've done this to you in a past life. And every time you stayed with them and gone back to them and it prevented you from getting with this, um, someone who would treat you like you deserve to be treated better than you've ever been treated and see you as an equal and put you on a pedestal. This person says they see life differently now and they trusted, I trusted you. I feel like that is a projection right there. I trusted you. I feel like, of course, you could have cheated on this person as well to get where it resonates. Um, I miss hearing your voice. So they definitely miss hearing your voice. They miss being with you. What's the truth, please, spirit, from this situation? We'll ask for guidance here in just a minute. I wonder how you feel. They want to start over. I told you they're coming back in. It's going to be your choice. I'm cautioning you to just be careful if you do go back to this person. They hide their feelings. I just heard there could be a, a pregnancy that is un, that you don't know about. I feel so happy with you. I'm not over you. Okay. Can we get some more? Before I pull some tarot on it. I regret lying to you. I love you unconditionally. I just threw my cards. Yeah, this person was messy. All over the place. They were very sneaky though. You deserve so much better. I'm becoming a better person. It's time for me to heal now. This is the truth, okay? So many things remind me of you. We will be together again. So they are planning on coming back. They think you'll just forget about it in time. I know I crossed the line with you. This is the truth from this person. It was my fault, but I blamed you. I replay our conversations in my head over and over. I am so attracted to you. I'm starting to understand our connection. I am grateful for the spiritual lesson. I bury myself in work to forget you. Yeah, they're drinking to forget you. They're working all the time to forget you. You could have lived with this person or they're gonna ask you to move in. We need to let each other go. This is the truth, remember. I don't react when people mention you. Remember, we are still in shadow period of retrograde too. I wish I had treated you better. My life is not as together as it seems. So they're definitely hiding something here, okay? Spirit, what is, yep. It This had to end, so you think, okay. What was toxic had to end because it wasn't right for your highest good, okay? And if something is not right for your highest good, spirit will cause tower moment after tower moment every time you get back with this person until you get learn the lesson, okay? I feel like you've been going through a period of healing, and it's your destiny to be happy. They could be a Scorpio, a Cancer, or a Leo, okay? Don't have to be. 
I'm going to pull signs here in a minute. That's already two major arcana, so this is a huge shift. I first heard, have you learned the lesson? Have you changed? Like, I, I feel like you truly love this person. You know, there's a lot of arguing and fighting. You're fighting within yourself of what to do. You're going to fight within yourself of what to do. They are in toxic energy, yeah, and then pretend everything is fine. They're in shadow energy. They act like they're good. They act like they change. This is a huge warning from spirit. All right, they stabbed you in the back a lot. Time and time and time again. Get together, break up energy, lies, manipulation. What's your guidance here, spirit? Spirit says walk away. Can't make it up. I'm so sorry. You just deserve so much more than this. Yeah. Spirit's saying that they're ve they were very sneaky. If you get back with this person, there is going to be a tower moment. Or if you're currently with this person, there is going to be a tower moment. Because I feel like they didn't give and take equally. They were being too sneaky. You deserve to be happy. You deserve to have peace in your life. You deserve to have a happy wife, happy life, happy hubby, happy life, right? You deserve someone who's going to give and, t give and take equally with the Six of Pentacles here. I feel like Spirit is sending someone... One, this is a test, spiritual test for you. Yeah. Spirit's past judgment on this Emperor. Could be Emperor or Empress. See where it resonates. Because of the choices they've made, Spirit's past judgment on them. They are getting tower after tower, and they think you can save them from this tower. Okay, Spirit's like... They think that they can come in, and you're going to let your guard down. So just be aware, all right? They've been planning this for a while, I do feel. Some more. Yeah, this is a... Coming out of an emperor energy. Not in the reverse, but I'm getting a very sneaky energy. My stomach hurts. It's a knot. I feel like I'm going to puke. You know how, like, when Jimmy cheats on you, you, you just feel it? Especially if you're deeply connected to that person. That is what I'm feeling here. And, yeah. They're, they're making an immature love offer. They're coming in to make one, okay? It's cuffing season is what I just heard. They're stagnant. They're stuck. They're not... They didn't learn anything. Spirit saying, cut them out. This is not the lover for you, okay? This this person is coming. They are very much in toxic energy. I do feel um, entity attachment, shadow energy here. Um, the devil always just comes in to steal, kill, and destroy, and they always go for love. I feel like addictions or drinking have heavy addictions got in the way of the situation spirit saying speak your truth stand your ground um crows or ravens blackbirds could be significant as well as pine trees look the lover spell and the devil was right under it. this person is in heavy heavy devil toxic energy i'm telling you you do have an emperor coming that spirit wants to give you if you deny this person okay Spirit wants to bring in someone who is, yeah, I'm speaking truth here. You're going to gain some clarity on this situation and about this person. If you've hoped, wished, and prayed for this person, I feel like even though you were hurt and you've forgiven them, right? By not going back to them this and ending this situation, this is going, and not letting them stab you in the back anymore or hurt you, this is going to break a generational curse on your family. If you look back through your family's history, I feel like there's been abuse, there's been a lot of trauma, um, cheating, energy, okay? Yeah. Yep. This person is definitely in past life. There is a soulmate energy coming in. You could be going back to school studying, wanting to learn something new, and that's what you're guided to do to help you go live in your soul's purpose and create your heaven and on earth. I do feel someone else is coming in, though. Um, I, if you pass this test, you're meant to be a teacher of some sort or spiritual leader, counselor. Spirit's saying there is a passionate new start coming, but it's... It, Unfortunately, it's not with this person because you got the warning, okay? You know they're coming in quickly. Use your intuition. Listen to the signs. Pay attention, okay? They, they, you are their wish fulfillment empress. There's an emperor empress here, okay? I do, but your wish fulfillment is not this person. They think you, they think that you are theirs, but they, they juggled you, okay? But your balance, your true match is coming in if you pass the spiritual test. From death will come rebirth, and you're being transformed. You're being asked to transcend past this. And there's a healing energy here if you take the leap of faith and trust spirit. And don't miss the blessing when it comes in because you're so distracted by all the mess that you don't see the blessings in front of you. All right, rest and relax. I feel like this person stressed you out and hurt you a lot and it affected your health. Remain guarded. Spirit is bringing in the love that you're manifesting. But I don't feel like it's this person. You're also going to get abundance. And I feel like this person is not supposed to be anywhere around it. 
um, because of their ties to toxicity, okay? I'm sorry, please don't, to be the bearer, please don't shoot the messenger. <laughs> you know, I have to give the message as I see it. If you don't like truth readings, I am not the reader for you. I don't want to see anybody get hurt, and I'm not going to lie to you. You can do what you want, it is your life, but I will read it how spirit gives it to me because that is my job, okay? <sighs> Let me do this. Let's get another deck, and let's ask about the person coming in, okay? Spirit, can you tell me about this new energy coming in for my earth signs? Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Somebody here could be an earth sign and be married to somebody, and there will be a there needs to be a divorce. This person is abusive. This person is mean, cruel. They are causing you health issues. Is what I'm hearing. I'm hear I'm feeling heaviness in my heart. Uh, could be like breathing problems because of stress. Heart on her part. Just be careful, okay? breaks my heart like you're beautiful too like you are like you're good looking like you deserve so you deserve someone who loves you equally all right tell me about this new energy coming in spirit if they decide to leave the past in the past and heal you'll get your wish the love that you seek the happy family this person from the past is going to keep spying on you. They don't, they're coming back because they don't want you to be with anybody else, okay? Or they want to come back. Yeah, your true emperor is on the way. I told you. This is a spiritual test, so you do what you want. You don't have to listen. There could be a uh, Capricorn, Capric or Earth sign in the reverse, King of Pentacles. Waiting on your ship is waiting on their ships to sell in. They're wait they they're hoping to come back to you. So this new uh, this emperor, someone in emperor status, cannot come in. I do feel this new person um, is is well off money wise. Um, they're not poor by any means, and they are coming in. They're coming in in divine timing. Um, you, you know, I feel like it won't be long after you deny this person, and you're not you're going to be like you may even have to move. I'm hearing, but this, you will be successful. You are meant to tell your story, be seen and heard, and help others through their situations. Okay. Your wishes, prayers, and manifestations are being heard by the divine. You're co-creating with, you're encouraged to co-create with spirit, right? And get out of your head. This person makes you feel bound up, okay? Remember the reasons that you guys didn't work things out, okay? Spirit's saying, now's the time for you to wait, okay? Don't do anything, just work on your healing work on self i'm hearing self-love date yourself take yourself out work on you if you have children tend to them love them enjoy them and i feel like you lost family and friends even being with this person your two of cups is coming okay spirits bringing you this two of cups spirits bringing you this they're gonna and if you're in this situation god's gonna cause a tower moment to help you get out of the situation do not go back if this happens okay like, I just want to cry because, I'm sorry, guys. I know how you feel. I've been there. I... It's hard. It is. And you deserve so much more. I was, like, honestly, guys, I was, yeah, they're wanting to come in. And they don't want this new person to come in. They're going to try to cause fights. They're going to try to make you look, they've tried to make you look bad, try to ruin your name. I understand what that's like they're gonna try to make you think they've changed they've learned their lesson they want to hurt you they're mad if you've already split or if you do don't trust them please okay they're very immature and they don't want you to have this ten of cups there is somebody new coming in yeah I'm telling you if you get back with them there's gonna be a freaking tower the page of cups if you get back with this person from the past it's coming in quickly or if you're currently in the situation you need to be on your guard. It is coming to an end. If you're married or dating this person, or if they come back in, they, it ended for a reason. Please know that, okay? I see celebration soon with family and friends. I, I'm seeing you self-loving and growing. I, I hope that you do do that. You have, there's two different timelines here. Spirit saying, which one do you want to be in? You know, it's up to you. Only you can make this choice. No one can make it for you. But you deserve someone who's gonna love you and truly cherish you i feel like this person love bombed the hell out of you and i am so sorry i keep hearing surrender 
Alright. Your guardian angel is watching over you. Honey, your, I feel like you go or honeymoon phase attending someone's wedding. You can meet this new person attending someone's wedding. Someone's in a honeymoon phase or a love bomb. I heard love bombing phase. Tell me more, spirit. Yeah, spirit's saying communicate. Don't be afraid to talk to family or friends or people who have been through these things. Join support groups. Remember these readings, I have to say, lately for entertainment purposes only, but they're here to help you on your journey to see the warnings, to know what, what's coming up, okay? I do see someone here trying to compromise, forgive, and work it out, but there is someone else. There is a third party. Someone else is in the middle. Someone's trying to sabotage this. They don't want you to know. Someone's trying to sabotage the new energy that's coming in. Spirit's saying, give it time. Everything is in divine timing and let things flow. Go with the flow. You'll be surprised where it leads is what I heard. Yes. Ladybugs are significant. Luck is on your side, okay? Anything else for this? Love spell. You have been bewitched. This person is speaking manifestations, words, or spells, or, or you know, they're going to get back with me. Like, they're enchanting you, or somebody could have hired somebody. So you will be soon be moving, or there's a change of residence for you or them here soon. Or you can be moving in with a partner. Just be careful. They could ask you to move back in with them. They're, this person, I'm telling you, that abused you is a liar. Only you know your story. This true person, I do feel there's a distance between you. Um, this person spies on you continuously, even if you've moved away from them. And they could be, cons there could be some, someone, one of you could be trying to figure out your sex, your true sexuality, okay? Wait. Um, and manifest. Tell the universe exactly what you want in detail is what I'm hearing, okay? Air sign, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. Could be, don't have to be. Let me get the signs here. Let me pull out this air sign card. Let go. Make room for the beginning. It's on its way to you now. And pregnancy, someone could be expecting. They could be trying to get you pregnant, too, so that you don't leave them. I'm just letting you know. I feel like there could have been a miscarriage as well. So sorry. They, You or them could be a fire sign. That's Aries, Leo, Sag, Energy. Air sign, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. A Scorpio. Anything else? Could be a Leo. I mentioned some signs earlier as well. The Capricorn, you or them. One more. Could be an Earth sign, Gemini, Gemini, a Taurus, Virgo, or Capricorn. Okay, Sagittarius energy on the bottom. That's in their big three, or it, you're either your or their big three. That's your Sun, your Moon, or your Rising. Okay. As well as their be your or their Venus, okay. You're gonna know if this reading's for you. I'm sorry, guys. I will do. I'll be doing other love readings. Don't worry. Spirit saying, "Don't stop." I'm hearing journey every time I see that card. I hear the journey song. Don't stop believing. This is gonna happen within the next few months, but it hasn't already. A year from now, things are gonna be totally different. Ask your angels for help. You're going to be in a different romance in a year from now and be happier than you've ever expected to be. I feel like you have friends, or friends, family, people that have uh, been in abusive relationships as well. And they are in new relationships. And I feel like it gives you some kind of hope. I'm really sorry if you're going through this. Let me get you some um, love oracle guidance, archangel Michael guidance as well. Okay. Give me just a second. This is a lover's oracle. What is this collective in my sphere? None of these won't really come out. Wait. Don't rush into it. Allow nature to take its course. Don't rush into going back to them either. That's what I'm hearing. You don't also don't have to rush with this new person. Deep in my heart, you already know the answer. Do what feels, you already know the answer. Spirit says do what feels right. I feel like you know you're not supposed to be with this person if you're going through this abuse. I'm so sorry. If you need help, anything, you can email me, truthbetoldtransformations at gmail.com. I'll get you some resources. I'll tell you what I've done. 
I'm going to recommend you keep an emergency bag for you and your kids with a copy of your social security card or a social security card, birth certificate, things like that. I like hide it somewhere you can grab it and go or keep it in your car. Life is a series of constantly shifting cycles. When we resist change, we resist the natural flow of life and create unnecessary stress. Go with the flow. You'll be surprised where it leads. Like I said, I feel like there's been health problems because of stress. It could also be their sign. This doesn't have to be your sign. A message for you. I'm thinking of you this very moment. Your love fills me with light. I love you. I feel like this is from this person in the future on this, this other person. That Yeah, from, this is from the other person I pulled on that was that's in your energy. You do have a secret admirer as well. Someone that you, I feel like, work with or know. You're like friends with them, work with them, know them. They actually have a crush on you. Look deep within your heart. You will feel my love. My love for you is as deep as the ocean. Acceptance is the key to inner peace. At times we must accept things how they are. There is no point in trying to change that which is beyond our control. You may not always understand why certain things happen. However there, is, however, there is always a higher purpose to the events in your life. Through turmoil, a blessing will soon be revealed. So through this pain, yeah. And there's a friendship here that you need to nurture the bonds. Nurture the bonds of a friendship within the, your really Nurture the bonds of friendship within a, your, your relationship and your love life will dramatically improve. I feel like there's a friend that really, that like actually likes you more than you know or you like them and it's equal you just don't know it i really do feel heavy marriage energy here i'm not gonna lie okay also saw picked up these three cards they were separate from the other ones and it was water sign cancer pisces scorpio libra and virgo you could be either any other signs as well okay um let's get you some angel guidance and i'll let y'all go i'm like i said if you guys are going through this i'm very sorry if there's any you know thing i can do let me know i do understand what it's like you can do it if i can do it you can do it and yes i was a single mom too i've done it more than once unfortunately but i'm you know i wouldn't be where i'm at now if i didn't make a commitment i'm hearing make a commitment to yourself stay committed to whatever aspect of, in your life relationships career path or self-development all need a strong sense of responsibility because you have a long way to go okay i feel like you i feel like you could go back to school or something um and i feel like you've been thinking about this i feel like they don't want you to make really good money because they are afraid to leave stay focused i feel like this person also or some, someone here, this person also is can be very lazy and not work, and they, like, demand you do stuff for them or have. Stay focused. That's not for everybody. It's time to, it's time for solitude and individual working. Be careful if there are interferences with your process occasionally. So, work on, on yourself. Be careful if there's interference of working on yourself. That's the negative energy trying to get in there and keep you stuck, okay, to bound, and bound just to toxicity. Ideas and solutions will come to your mind when you're alone, and to, and it will help with your plan. You need to make a plan. You do. Don't just leave, I'm hearing. It's not easy, I know. I've had to do it. Go with the flow. You'll be surprised where it leads. Unbind the rope that which has been, which has tied you up, and you, you will find your strength. You put in so much hard work. If, you're putting, if you put in so much hard work, then there should be no regrets. Float the f float freely, so you will land. So you and you will land in the in a place of peace. Okay. These have misprints on them, so I kind of and I also hear my guides talking, and they're like telling me what <laughs> words to change and stuff. So, all right, let's get you some Archangel Michael guidance, and I'll let you guys go. Archangel Michael, what guidance do you have for this collective, whoever this reading is for? And this, you could have also broken up with this person, so it could also be someone who's coming back in your energy, or this is going to happen, okay? Alright, here's your guidance. This is something about your life's purpose. I feel like you're about to find out what it is. Spirit wants you to explore your options, I feel, when it comes to love, honestly. But you need to explore some options. You'll intuitively know what that is for you. Spirit says have confidence in yourself. Know that you're beautiful and you're amazing. You need to shield yourself and protect yourself. Okay? Take your time to make this decision. Ask Archangel Michael to help you with this situation. Of course, if you're ever in danger or you're being abused, please. Get out. Do it safely. 
I've actually helped people. I read for them between cards and downloads and help them get out safely and they had a whole new life I've done it with three different people in the last six you know in six years I've been reading so but remember I have to say this legal disclaimer this is for entertainment purposes only this is only meant to help guide you but ultimately you are the decision maker okay admit the truth to yourself and act accordingly that's what Archangel Michael says anything else spirit for this collective make a commitment i feel it's make a commitment to yourself is what i heard it's children if you have any to the divine god you you are guarded and protected okay this person cannot take your children from you i feel like you're scared of that that may be a reason they threatened this i do feel like you love them i'm so sorry i'm here like i said if i can help in any way and if you are going through a situation like this, and I will ask my guy, my guys will tell me if you're lying to me, and you need a reading, I will do it for you. Just message me, okay? I will see what I can do to help you. Um, you'll just have to, you know, you know, agree that you know that this is only guidance to help you, and you know, I have to take. I might, you know. So. Um, you need. I feel. I'm hearing pink. Rose Quartz will be help you with your self-love as well as um, for the P you have PTSD I do feel this will help with love and relationships Water watermelon tourmaline will help with love and relationships PTSD peace of mind and relaxation okay and you also need this all right and I'm hearing you need selenite and black tourmaline the combination will help cleanse your aura and protect you as well um, you can ask for Archangel Michael's help. He will come in and help you. I always say Archangel Michael to the left of me, Archangel Michael to the right of me, Archangel Michael to the front of me, Archangel Michael behind me, Archangel Michael above me, Archangel Michael below me, Archangel Michael is all around me. Help me help, or just say help me, help me, help me, Archangel Michael, and he will help you. And he will intervene, but you will have, there will be a tower of some sort. Don't be surprised when that happens, okay? I feel like you need to put a DVP on this person, but you're scared maybe because of their family and because of what they'll do, and they threaten to take the kids. If you put a DVP, they can't. But it, the choice is yours, and I do understand. I've been in, in those situations before, and it took me a while to leave, too. I just want you to know I'm not here to tear you down. I'm just here to tell you what I'm seeing in the cards and from spirit. This is sh solely what I'm told to read and how I'm told to read it. Okay? So, but if I can help in any way, please let me know. I love you. You deserve everything. The love that you deserve, the love that you give to others. You really do, especially this person. You deserve the love that you get from from someone that you give them they i wish you know what i mean i'm not saying they don't love you i just feel like they i feel drinking i'm not gonna lie or there could be drugs um but i feel drinking mostly i just feel cheating energy i'm so sorry but i do understand and i'm here for you if i can help in any way and i will definitely pray for you and um if you would like i will send you some healing just let me know you can even just if you know comment um a green heart below and i will know to send your through your account i won't know your real name or anything but just any of the energy and it will come to you okay all right i love you and you got this you're stronger than you know you look what you made it through so all the, already in life okay i know time times you're going through a hard time but i promise you you're not alone your spirit team is there to help you and i'm here to help if, it, if i can in any way i love you